In this video, we're going to look at exponential integration. So exponential integration is the opposite of exponential differentiation. So here we've got the integral of e to the power of x with respect to x. If you remember, when we differentiated e to the power of x, it stayed as e to the power of x. So when we integrate it, it stays as e to the power of x. So the integral of e to the power of x with respect to x is e to the power of x plus c. On the other side here, I've got the integral of 1 over x with respect to x. And the integral of that is ln x. But we put ln mod x. So whenever we're integrating, we put mod x because we can't put a negative into ln. It's not defined. We can't do it. So ln mod x plus c is the integral of 1 over x, and that's because ln x differentiated gave us 1 over x. So it's just the opposite. The other way around, if we integrate 1 over x, we get ln mod x plus c. Okay, here are some questions. They are using the reverse chain rule or U substitution if you prefer that method. I'm going to do the reverse chain rule because it's quicker. So we've got the integral of e to the power of 5x plus 1 with respect to x. So we can think of 5x plus 1 as our bracket. So we've got, well it's going to stay the same. So when we integrate it, we're going to have e to the power of 5x plus 1 still, but then we're going to divide by the bracket differentiated. So if I divide by the bracket differentiated, which is 5, I'll put a fifth. Same thing. So we've got a fifth e to the power of 5x plus 1 plus c. And if we differentiated that, we'll get back to our question. Same thing over here. So we're going to integrate it normally. So whenever we've got 1 over x or something like 1 over x, it's going to go to ln. So we'll have 5 ln 2x plus 3. And we're going to divide by the bracket differentiated, which is 2 in this case, which gives us 5 over 2 ln 2x plus 3 and plus c. Okay, two more questions. Pause the video, give them a go, and then press play when you're ready to go through. Okay, so the first question, we're going to integrate it normally, so it will stay exactly the same. And then divide by the bracket differentiated, which is 4 in this case. And the 4 is going to cancel, so that gives us e to the power of 4x minus 2 plus c. The second question, so we'll integrate it normally, so 2 ln 7x plus 3. Divide by the bracket differentiated, which is 7. So that would be 2 sevenths ln 7x plus 3 plus c. Okay, 